Now, Kalpun Piso here. Christian nuts expose. Interesting. You should have said Christ psychotics. Um, people are the Luda still live in the 12th century. That makes them retarded. To explain the why in God Non Believers, excellent video. Why am I not surprised that you, man, who like to masturbate, who like to pull up the bottom, and no more not to buy Probably passed out little drinks that would help ease you into a nice sleep that was filled with vision. Yeah, the Bible. They used. It is known that the Hebrews gave wine to the sick and the injured. Yeah. We, they also gave more powerful drugs. Yeah, with mushrooms. It's the only way you guys got. In biblical times, physicians understood opium's unrivaled power to ease the sufferer's pain. The problem with this uh, very ignorant and deluded and schizotypal Christ psychotic individual is his ignorance. He doesn't realize that. Uh, he is creating all those delusions with his brain. He belongs in a mental institution. Uh, the university or the school, they should have uh, invited some schizophrenic to speak. And it will, it will sound exactly the same. All of this, this religious beliefs and all this mythology is started in the Roman Empire. Well, actually in Egypt, but the Roman Empire is the one that actually gave it to us. That's where Christianity was formed, from the cult of Divus Julius, from uh, Julius Caesar and the rest. But they all use sacraments, which were hallucinogenic materials and substances, uh, which is the apples of Apollo, which is the actually, it was a mushroom, but they they thought it was an apple, something that fell off a tree because, you know, they ate it and of course they saw, they saw God and everybody else. <laughs> so actually, uh, you see them here demonstrated this Garden of Eden with Eve and the talking snake, nothing but mushrooms. As you can see here, came from the Roman mythology, even the snake, which represents the penis. So when this retard talk about masturbation, ah, believe in penis Christ, the Lord and Savior. Uh, from Egyptian mythology, the god Atun that masturbated and created the world. Yes, Venus is sacred, Venus Christ. Here's, here's the evidence, the god Atun masturbating on the left, and here's a detail of the supplicant kneeling down holding the god waiting for the semen, and here is the Ouroboros ingesting the semen. Uh, all religions do that. Here is the uh, Amanita Muscari Mosrum or the Apples of Apollo. Uh, here is the uh, Emperor Commodus about 180 uh, CE holding the Apples of Apollo or the Apples of the Hesperids. Ah, there are many, many texts, words of God. There are many Bibles. The Bible is actually modern. It was written in the 5th century, a compendium of a different text. There are many, many of them. My favorite religious text that everybody should believe in it, because it's, it's the truth, really the truth, the Redentor, the Lord and Savior. Uh, this is the true book. The Lord and Savior, Winnie the Pooh. He was even sacrificed. Look at this. I mean, you can find any more real. The prophecy. Look at this. He cross, sacrifice, Winnie the Pooh, repent. It is as real as the rest. All product of the brain, malfunctioning brains. I sure love to slap the deluded Christians with the evidence to what I'm saying is true. Archaeological history, you can see them in the tombs. And uh, when they pray like this, to the guy, they're sucking dick, you know. Semen was sacred. So when you see people in church doing this business like this, and oh Lord, the sucking dick is right there in the Egyptian Book of the Dead. Evidence, evidence. 3,500 year old papyrus of Ani at the British Museum. You can see it. <laughs> so hey, worship Venus Christ, and you go like this, because you hold it like this, and then you bless like that. That's where the uh, uh, the uh, the Catholic Church got their blessing is from holding it, the penis like this, the sacred, and then you 
do that and do the blessing. 2300 year old vase clearly showing the fawn collecting the river of life. Semen and the latest breast milk was considered the same liquid, come from the gods. And uh, they wanted to absorb it. That's the reason the mother of the Lord <laughs> always have show the nipple, which is equivalent to the glands of the penis, of the Lord Penis Christ, and it shoots the uh, river of life, like into the mouth of the saint. <laughs> People are so deluded when they believe in this nonsense. Religions, all religions are based on sex, sacred sex. Masturbation is sacred, copulation is sacred, all those acts are sacred people. Get real. Enjoy sex. Revere it. That's what we create gods with our, with our penises. And the vagina, of course. We're in the 21st century, not the 12th. Come on, Virgin Mary, give me some milk. Then I want to sack little peepee of uh, baby Jesus. Here is, look at the gesture. It's actually a sacred gesture of the fallows. Here is a, a Roman goddess with the fruit, the sacred fruit, and here is the snake uh, and, uh, in the garden, which is actually a Roman uh, depiction. Uh, you can see here uh, Emperor Augustus with the, with the scepter. Look at what he has in the scepter. Opium bud, because it was sacred. Here are the opium buds that you see. It's all, everything, and even flowers in the Roman... Uh, uh, were uh, actually uh, hallucinogenic flowers in the, in the monuments and the arches. Uh, here you see more of the uh, poppy seeds. Ah, here are the delusions, the Mormon's delusions of the guy that uh, probably took some mushrooms, Joseph Smith, about 1820s. Here it is. And all about this. Angel up here, two stones, the umin and the thumen. And with this stone he was going to, and the breastplate, he was going to translate some plates that were hidden in a farm. <laughs> Martians, my friend, these people are psychotic. People that believe in God are deluded. We are in the 21st century. We're not in the 12th century. Neurology clearly proves that we create God and all the delusions with the brain. This, this is a term for these people that believe in these things. They are called schizotypal, schizophrenic, temporal love epileptic, and uh, deluded. And since they live in the, 20, in the 12th century, believing in all that, they're actually retarded. So anti-gay, he even made an anti-gay song. Let's enjoy. Yes, Jesus Christ is God. He says it right in here. King James Version of the Bible. You know who King James was? Gay King James. The retard in the, the king that was very gay. He was a sinful. I mean, this guy was a homosexual to the top. He is the one who translated the Geneva Bible because he didn't like it, and he wanted to translate his own Bible in England. And uh, the reason that when he did that, the Puritans didn't like it <laughs> because they liked the Geneva Bible, and they were pure, so therefore they went into the Mayflower here to, uh, to pervert the natives. In 1622, the retards that came in the Mayflower. But King James Version... It's a gay Bible. It's a sinful Bible. <laughs> he better get his facts straight. These Baptists and all these lunatics and nuts, hey, they have the Kim James Version, gay men version of the Bible. Here is the author of the Bible, which the homophobic Christ psychotics love. Here is Venus Christ in ancient Egypt, 3,000 years ago, and you'll see it here, collecting the river of life, or trying to, and uh, there is uh, another version of the Lord Penis Christ from Scandinavia. One must realize the more one knows, the more difficult for others to lie to you. So these people should be set straight and, and uh, taken away and put in mental institution. They are readers of only one book and they, um, they don't belong free. They, they have to be cured from their disease. They are no different than the schizotypal. Pachyderum.